Hey all, uh, welcome to One Minute CM again. Uh, we have uh, Vipasha Kiran with us uh, joining in. Thanks Vipasha for taking time out. Uh, quick introduction uh, about Vipasha and let's see how she does with the rapid fire questions and you know what is that she would focus on One Minute CM. Uh, so uh, quick introduction, Vipasha is an entrepreneur. She is an independent filmmaker. Uh, she is a very good storyteller and uh, obviously a dreamer because she is an entrepreneur. Uh, she has uh, good experience in media industry and uh, she has uh, achieved a couple of awards uh, in a short time. Uh, she won the uh, national and international awards for creative video production and uh, you know she's done a lot of things with respect to aesthetics. Uh, she is focusing on solving uh, real world problems uh, for organization, educational institutions, corporates, startups, uh, you know, in a storytelling way. Uh, she has been awarded uh, the UK Asia Film Festival. She has been awarded uh, for Telangana Sri Sakti Award uh, for 2009. And uh, she is among the top uh, six video production companies in Hyderabad. Uh, so that's that's a lot in short time. Uh, Vipasha, thanks for joining in. Maybe you can give a quick introduction about yourself to our new friends uh, because we'll start watching out for you uh, going forward. Yeah, thank you so much, Ravi, first of all, uh, for this opportunity to share my like story and i will also thank ashrita so she was the one who introduced me to you i just uh, admire her a lot yeah so, you're one of them you're one of them where matlab, uh, it you know it takes a friend to recommend and you know push that yes you should do it so vipasha is one of them so please go ahead vipasha yeah thank you so much yeah so uh, basically i am uh, from rachi uh -huh. uh, the uh, capital of Jharkhand and uh, uh, just uh, just a minute yeah, sure. okay. so I started my journey like uh, uh, when I was uh, studying in uh, plus two uh, in 12th then my uh, father was like interested in me going to engineering and medical field so then I was like I don't want to go in these field like the convention one i want to do something else that time i was not knowing that mass communication or media or video how it is doing so then uh, suddenly i saw an advertisement in a newspaper and uh, my only college that was like uh, famous in rachi san Xavier's, that was the advertisement there and they called the uh, uh, applic all for application and i went there so my like, father was not happy Okay. He was like, you know, you should do engineering and medical because all my cousins were in this field. And so I somehow managed to convince him. And with the help of my mother, mm -hmm. I like started, like went to college and did uh, pass the exam and got selected for like only 25 students got selected in, the, in that batch. Okay. So I was the one. So that journey, like for three years, I studied the bachelor's in like mass communication and how video, how we make video, how it goes, to, oh, a lot of effort goes to scripting, all the technical aspects, also the aesthetical aspects. Right. So that was a very beautiful journey and very precious journey in my life. Then like later on, I went on to Delhi for further studies and there I uh, started my career also in mm -hmm. like, various field news channel production houses that i learned a lot i like i remember i worked after i uh, like my first internship i was working three shift so okay. i was working morning till evening evening to night then night to morning like i was not going back to my hostel i was so in that uh, moment so my uh, all uh, like seniors were telling go back home and take some rest so I was, no, I will learn, I will learn. I was like that. So that journey continues. And uh, after marriage, uh, there was a little gap in my career because of kid and I was not in India, I was abroad. So, but there also I didn't stop. I learned new, new things. Like I learned online, I online education. I learned a lot of new things. Work with few NGOs there also voluntarily. So I keep on, but in my head, it was that when I come back, I will do again. I will again uh, redo, restart my career. 
so then finally i came back and i started uh, like uh, applying again and then for two days i got uh, an offer from a startup in hyderabad there i learned a lot of things and that was a good exposure then during that course that entrepreneur wala that <laughs> that came inside me that i can also do something so i because of some issues i left that job but during that time that sabbatical that i have taken that that gap uh, i was not uh, thinking of like leaving this field and uh, doing something else i again started planning and uh, what, what i could i can do uh, uh, to build my career uplift my career in my own way like i was a very separate uh, like uh, thinking about like working as a video perspective also so i started my own uh, venture in december 2019 Okay. i started uh, like registering on december 2019 but i was working for one year like full 2019 i was working towards it so uh, during these times i will specially mention like my family uh, like mm-hmm. i got complete support okay. like my in law like uh, my in laws father in law mother in law they were like completely okay kya chahiye aapko like we will give you all support you go out you do your work we will be uh, and taking care of like kids and all like they were so supportive my husband my parents so the journey still continues but i will always like feel lo- so much like uh, love and grateful to god that they gave me uh, parents like them and partner like my husband like really supportive So this is my small journey yeah. coming back after a sabbatical. So especially kya hota hai directors when when you are into direction you are mostly behind the scenes and you you yes. make uh, the actors you you make the script you make sure that everybody is acting their role and you have the entire story the way you designed it. But you know when it comes to you know doing your own story you know kaisa journey hua tha start hua tha and you know it becomes very difficult to uh, you know mention that but yes it takes a lot of work uh, to reach there so yeah. uh, tell us uh, something about the awards which you won you know how it started uh, you yeah, know what's the story yeah. behind those two yeah. awards uh, like uh, i will tell you one thing like from my childhood only my parents was like uh, uh, always pushing me to participate like competitions and i was in a yoga competition karate like which painting so i was in all competition and that competitiveness was inside me always winning and always like doing good in whatever uh, field i was there so that continued like when i started uh, this uh, my company within like 3 uh, 4 months um, uh, i got this award telangana stri shakti award because i want to share why i got this award because of my one uh, documentary that was like uh, based on a real story of a 90 uh, person disabled uh, uh, person dr sai kartha uh, he is the man so i was so in, like uh, moved by his story that i wanted to do the story and he told uh, me that was a like real difficult uh, thing to do because he is 90 percent disabled and i have to uh, make a good story out of his life like key things what to highlight what not to highlight so that uh, i did it like uh, in one day we uh, shooted that documentary and i blindly submitted to all uh, film festivals international film festival I, nothing like i didn't hoped anything it was like my wish okay i will submit everyone do that independent film make i will also do that but uh, that was a turning point when i got like six seven international film festival selection and uh, one of the film festival uk asian film festival there uh, we got uh, we were the top 10 finalist so i was the only one representing india they called me also for the premier but unfortunately i was not able to attend due to some reason so that film the wheelchair warrior of india that made me uh, this journey of awards came through that only so this telangana sri shakti award and other awards that came through that one film that touched so many 
uh, uh, people heart and like a lot of messages i got from people like really an amazing story that was so these awards are like that and within few like uh, within 6 months of my opening my company i was recognized as top 6 video production house in hyderabad so that was also a very like milestone achievement for us in a very short span of time so i'm very grateful to god that all these happen in a very short span of time cool. congrats that that's definitely you know the shortest uh, time period which anybody in any category yeah. can win awards so where can we see this particular documentary you know is is it available can, on youtube yeah or? you can yeah it is available on youtube on our youtube channel it mm-hmm. is available there and you can watch it it is very inspiring because we uh, after making this documentary like we as a filmmaker we just watch them like we see their life so closely hmm. so when i was doing this documentary i was like uh, moved and i i like got to understand a lot more about life like how he is doing all these things like he is 90% disabled still he is he is acclaimed he is highly acclaimed person he also has uh, like uh, awarded a like, lot of awards in his uh That's name right. he is really famous so i thought like we can also do something if he can do we are like pretty much uh, able to do anything in life if he can do so what so is that, the name of the documentary what is the name of the the wheelchair warrior of india the wheelchair so we, warrior of india yeah okay. it is the story based on dr sai costa yeah, yeah. Nice. So I'll mention the link here down below uh, after this particular yeah. video. So friends, please yeah. go to it and you know share, spread the word out. And you know, I definitely want to know about the person myself. So I'll definitely yeah. go to it. Yeah, very inspirational, ever smiling person, and he always take out time to speak to me personally. Is is very like now we are friends. So he's just twenty nine year old. So he's very young. Nice. So, uh, Vipasha, we want to know be- uh, you better. So, are you ready for the rapid fire questions? Yeah, uh, I'm ready. Yeah. <laughs> What is the best thing that has happened in your life? Hmm. Best thing, like I started my company. I was in a uh, in a mindset that I have to return back, right? Mm-hmm. so i that that gap in my career like i was uh, really depressed and i was not happy sometimes i also like fight my with my husband like i'm not doing what i am supposed to do i just love videos i just love i love creating videos so that is i think that will the one like my dream come true so in this particular video uh, what is the best uh, shot moment that you you know you could capture out of your documentary yeah yeah the mother and uh, uh, the son relationship like so un- unconditional relationship between parents and child like you don't you don't uh, parents don't judge their kids irrespective of whatever uh, their qualities or if they don't have any qualities like it's like completely like soulful relationship between parents and uh, their child so i saw that like lively uh, how um, his mother is taking care of him irrespective of like so many things she has to do like each and everything she has to do from tip to bottom like now i have a 9 year old kid uh, sometimes i leave him right uh, you do it by yourself but i can see uh, her taking care of him as a like small child so that was like very touching moment for me as a mother i just salute her uh, what what is the funniest part about you i mean you know based on your profile and all that you look to be very reserved serious so what is the funniest part of you with her uh, about vipasha that we are not aware of funniest yeah i am introvert i don't mingle with people a lot uh funniest part i think you can ask uh, my friends i don't think i ever do like i'm such a serious person i like, don't involve in jokes and i'm i'm, I'm a serious kind of person yeah okay funniest movie, yeah i don't remember any such moment yeah a uh, one funny thing i uh, like i want to share like when i was abroad and uh, 
uh, we used to like we have a habit of hanging clothes outside right right so i also did the same thing like when my first visit and first day outside india so i got a call from the landlord so in a in a like she was just scolding me <laughs> so what are you doing why are, why have you put clothes outside and i just told her yes we did like this in india so she was she started scolding me i was starting like explaining her why i did that so that was like funny moment she was not understanding me i was not understanding her into a different kind of thing i was scared of her so i keep on like communicating in a different way so that she don't understand what i am telling her that was a funny conversation between us like cultural difference true uh, what is that one thing really annoys you at home uh when someone like lie to me i just hate uh, i i just uh, like anything can uh, like you can uh, hide just say the truth uh, no need to hide anything it can be bitter it can like have drastic effect on other uh, person but, but i don't uh, yeah i don't like liars i can't take so with your entire family jo aapka family hai usme who is your bestie apart from your mom and dad who is that person who is really close to you my son yeah not from your family i mean ghar se chhod ke my family mama chacha sort of uh, this thing whom you really i'm close to my i'm close to my sister i'm very close in a family like um, mother father sister uh, husband mm-hmm. i don't go beyond that so this is my world so i am in this world so i'm close to my sister so i share everything i don't share a lot of thing to outsiders even uh, anyone outside my family i keep it reserved yeah i heard uh, something about your super mom so can you tell about your mom you know, i heard she is super active she is always like uh, to the yes. next level running everything so can you just talk about her yeah my mom is like whatever i am here uh, because of my mummy i just love her uh, why because uh, uh, from childhood i have seen her uh, so much hard working like whatever she was doing she was doing perfectly like perfection uh, she has to do that on uh, managing uh, work plus home i have seen that so whatever i am here today because of my mummy she uh, she is like my backbone when i was like starting my uh, this journey of uh, this is not easy entrepreneurial journey is not easy so it like uh, lot of rough pitches will be there and it's not an easy start to leave your job and then start something new from scratch so when i was starting there was no one i was alone i was shooting i was writing i was editing i was doing everything so my mom was i was doing the day and night like she was calling me all the time like kya kar rahe ho beta and always she was like motivating me yeah tum kar sakti ho you can do and i just love you go so that support always like whenever i am low in my like uh, anything work and family uh, she is always the support and she is tech savvy also she is like uh, uh, i've never seen uh, like a mom like her I, i i can tell about my mom like when facebook started she was on facebook when uh, linkedin started she was on linkedin when tiktok started she was on tiktok instagram now on zoom like th- this is a recent thing like uh, two days back was my birthday so uh, i planned like we have a zoom celebration so i called her she said yeah i know zoom you know zoom i said ma'am what are you calling on zoom <laughs> now it is morning on zoom so she said yeah to so this zoom now you can just have a, like more people join in and have discussion so maine bola yes mummy i am also planning this let's have a celebration on zoom birthday celebration so i was so, so sweet of her her and you know she is so uh, you know uh, forward with respect to you know the technology so that, that's really inspirational yeah so, yeah what, what is she that and yeah she always texted us like ye kaise karte hain like how do online payments and all these she is not like ki abhi bacche kar denge 
she want to learn she is a computer she know technology she okay. she can do anything in computer so uh, she learned in like gradually with us like mm. with the help of kids she never said i will not do it do it you can help us no i will do it teach me and i will do it so i love you mom you are listening <laughs> Nice what is the weirdest thing that you've done at school? See, I'm very uh, like studious. I was very studious. Kuch bhi aisa nahi kya maine. I I was really very studious. I was participating in all co-curricular activities. Uh, more into studies. So I never done any weird thing in my school. Yeah. So, uh. No, never. Never. Yeah. No. So you missed that particular part of you. So as a girl, can you describe yourself as a girl? As a girl, yeah. So, uh, I am uh, like I'm a family, uh, mm-hmm. family uh, uh, focused girl. I love like love to be with family, and if my family support is not there, I'm nowhere. like okay. that is what describes me like my family that is my strength so uh, as a girl i like i am i'm loving in nature i love people who take care who understand like equal uh, like level of relationship like i understand them they understand me so uh, that is very important for me so that's why family is very important for me because i cannot uh, uh, expect that same thing from outsiders Okay. Now talking about documentary and movies, what what were your recent uh, good movies which had a good message and you know you felt you know I should do something like this? Yeah, uh, uh, not recently, but I will definitely uh, want to share one movie that I uh, made uh, last year on Valentine's Day. It was a different Valentine's Day movie. It was on uh, my in-laws. Okay. I will share that. bonding of them like uh, they are like 65 plus both mm-hmm. of same age same age and how they respect each other it's a like long journey but they still now how they respect uh, the relationship and how they are taking care of each other they like they are like uh, what do you call in hindi diya and bati you cannot separate them you cannot separate them i made a movie on them that is based on that love that crucial love that is like uh, my mother in law health is uh, not very good but um, my father in law is taking how much care like nowadays no husband can do that i can bet on that no husband can take care like how he is taking care of his wife so i will also recommend to watch that movie that is based on like true relationship that is close to my heart and how you should uh, like uh, like grow your relationship together it is not about like expecting something from each other mm-hmm. but it is a different kind of relationship like Um, for ever sure. wala relationship yeah, yeah. I, i will that definitely is, i will definitely see it but i will definitely not show it to my wife because the expectations bade aayenge but yes <laughs> i keep on telling my husband every time after marriage like till we are like 10 uh, 10th year of marriage so i told him every day uh, so you will never be like your father like he is so like so loving i cannot explain in words you have to see that uh, movie to like experience that uh, love like how much But yeah it, apart from your work you should have seen some movie something outside in bollywood or tollywood yeah. that has really yeah, yeah. Uh, made an impact recently, uh, recently. Yeah. yeah recently i am like uh, i have seen one movie uh, because i am from film uh, Uh, background so my movies bhi i uh, just saw in a different angle we don't see through like uh, layman perspectives kaisa story angle technical all those things so i have seen recently one marathi movie it is a long uh, old movie that is based on harish chandra like first film so mm-hmm. harish chandra uh, factory that is the name of a marathi movie that is really good movie to watch and also recently i have seen uh, uh the founder movie uh and one more movie i have seen 
the social network these are the recent movies i have watched due to yeah, my okay. interest in like, to learn entrepreneurship like how these yeah. uh, big companies the giant have built their empire yeah founder so is a good movie because uh, you know you actually see that the founder is not actual founder of kfc and uh, uh, sorry yeah. mcdonald and you know how uh, the company takes a completely different angle after uh, he takes over so it's a good yeah, movie I, i told my kid i will never eat uh, burger why you just asked me why because i was so sad feeling sad the story was not uh, uh, like uh, that was not related to me that i felt like it is not good that uh, what happened to the founder of mcdonalds so i told my kid that i will never eat burger now it will why mom why so it was it was like he told me no mama it is okay you can eat burger now <laughs> yeah so i watch movies like this it touched me personally sometimes Yeah, we also have some comments and compliments coming in about your work, uh, the Valentine's Day uh, movie, which has made an impact both for Ashwita and uh, uh, Vishakha Vikram. And we have Jay Prakash who's uh, complimenting on uh, Hari Chandrachi Factory. Is one yeah, movie is, which has made. Yeah, really good movie. Yeah. So I think there was one movie that the kids were watching. Uh, it's by a kid, I think. Uh, Chachi or something like that. It's a short uh, movie, but uh, a kids' movie, and which made everybody cry. So I miss that. I I think I have to watch it. Uh, but yeah, I think we are moving to a trend where you don't need big celebrities to uh, make an impact or create a movie uh, or a message. So I think uh, we are evolving a lot in terms of movie making, and uh, you know, good good stories coming around. So yeah, it's all about stories it's all about stories techniques doesn't matter it's all about story what uh, like, if it touches your heart then you can win your audience it doesn't matter which camera what techniques so it's only the story that will touch your audience heart okay next question stand up on the bench ye kitne baar kiya tha school mein I was very good student at school. Like, yeah, still I mean, my teacher. Answer, answer, answer. This answer for everything you have to answer. Yeah, <laughs> still my uh, yeah, still my teachers are there uh, uh, on Facebook. Like, they always appreciate whatever. So never, ऐसा कभी नहीं हुआ. Like one time yeah, it happened. ऐसा नहीं हो सकता. I mean, you know, even your really good kid and all that, somebody's musty and all that, you get caught. So, एक बार तो बेंच के ऊपर या स्कूल के बाहर, क्लास के बाहर खड़ा होना. This is written for every kid. So, if you have not experienced that, I I really don't believe that. Okay, like I don't uh, remember as such, but uh, something like I don't know incidents. uh yeah i was standing outside my class uh, for what reason i like maybe homework nahi kiya ho and uh, not for any any weird behavior maybe like related to studies only so then uh, that what happened i was standing outside my class and wo cricket ball seniors khel rahe hote hain ground mein and that go <laughs> that came and i was like i fell down and then my punishment and like Two minutes ही हुआ था मुझे punishment मिले हुए and that incident happened and then teacher came and वो punishment भी चला गया like first time I think that was the first time last punishment I got so your direction बचपन से ही शुरू हो गया था as soon as you went out you you made the guys hit you so that you can go back so mm, maybe yeah <laughs> yeah it Good was there Yeah. Yeah. One uh, thing also for school, one thing I want to share because you are asking questions yes. from school day. Uh, like I was very studious. I told you right, but I uh, was only one time failed. First, first time. So why? That is a very silly reason. I why I failed. Like uh, you got a schedule uh, in three or fourth grade. I remember. So you got a schedule this date, uh, this uh, subject, and uh, five days. So you get it. then somehow i missed confused with the dates and mujhe science padhna tha and i read gk pad ke chali gayi main general knowledge and the exam was of uh, science and uh, 
तभी लाइक पासिंग मार्क्स भी नहीं आया एंड आई वाज लाइक मार्क्ड फेल सो दैट वाज लाइक रियली फर्स्ट टाइम एंड लास्ट टाइम दैट वाज द स्टुपिडिटी ऑफ मी लाइक आई डिडंट रिमेंबर व्हिच डे वाज व्हाट सब्जेक्ट एग्जाम वाज देयर एंड दैट वाज द फर्स्ट थिंग दैट वाज द थिंग आई रिमेंबर फ्रॉम माय स्कूल डेज नथिंग एल्स लाइक नथिंग वियर्ड बिहेवियर फ्रॉम माय स्कूल so what was your attire during that particular day matlab do choti you know can you describe yourself now you are a director so you have to do this really good uh, you oh. cannot give me excuse uh, that mai bahut achhi bachchi thi i know your mom is watching so no excuses saying that mai chata you have to describe the way you were dressed and you know your attire and all that hmm okay so yeah we, I... we have to know how you know you visualize and how can you articulate what you are you were that time या आई वॉज लाइक शॉर्ट हेयर मेरे पापा को लॉन्ग हेयर पसंद नहीं था वाई बिकॉज स्कूल जाने में देर हो जाएगी ही वॉज वेरी पंचुअल सो ही नेवर अलाउड एस टू ग्रो अवर हेयर नहीं 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 जल्दी फास्ट रेडी होके स्कूल जाना है सो शॉर्ट हेयर या हेयर बैंड एंड वेरी डिसेंट आई लव टू ड्रेस अप माई प्रेस माई स्कूल ड्रेस सो आई टूक लाइक वन आर टू प्रेस माई ड्रेस यू नो माई फेवरेट थिंग टू डू प्लेट्स लाइक गर्ल्स इट वॉज अ को एड स्कूल सो लाइक वेन लाइक yeah one one hour i used to press plates by plates i like love my dress to be neat and clean so that uh, that i used to like very like simple i was like very simple like short hair thoda hair band laga ke and like neat and clean uh, so you dress. had ribbon colored ribbons like red ribbon or blue ribbon as a house ribbon for you uh yeah there were no ribbon uh, there were like uh, yeah dress colors were there so i suppose i was in red color uh, house so there were like four five house and i was in red color house i was captain of uh, my house mm-hmm. so i was like leading and one our most interesting thing i will tell you like in school whenever i cry like in sports competition in any uh, competition whichever day i cry like mujhe prize nahi milega that day i won the prize so my <laughs> mummy जिस बार भी मैं नहीं रोई ना तो मम्मी ने कहा इस बार प्राइज नहीं आएगा यू हैव टू क्राइन यू प्राइज सो एवरी टाइम आई यूज टू डू मुझे प्राइज नहीं आएगा यूज टू क्राई अलॉट एंड देन फाइनली अनाउंस होता था कि आई गॉट द प्राइज सो दिस वॉज द इंसिडेंट हैपन होल माई स्कूल लाइफ टिल टेंथ एवरी टाइम इट हैपन टू मी इन दिस योर स्कूल डेज डिड यू एवर डू दो skit uh skit uh, no uh, but i was uh, in uh, like annual day i was like uh, participating in like uh, theme based annual day events like uh, you represent some states and you have to represent that uh, character from assam or from uh, any a jammu from any other state you have to dress up so like that uh, not skit particularly i was not uh, till school days uh, till 10th i was not uh, at all interested in uh, these things yeah i was very studious so i was not distracted by these things. yeah after 10th i got into these things ki mujhe video mein kuch karna hai film mein kuch karna hai main bachpan se hi decide kar liya tha mere ko kuch nahi karana karana hai as a director so i think you decided <laughs> but uh, tell me you know during your school days were you the one who was uh, polishing your shoes and you know those the canvas shoes aate the white wale yes. so yes. usko white polish karna padta tha once in a week you had this particular day either friday or some schools had wednesday so aap karte the ya aapke daddy i mean were you the largely bachche so my dad and my dad mere papa ne mujhe breakfast bhi karaya hai so i used to dress up main comb kar rahi hu aur papa mujhe breakfast kara rahe hain so he was very punctual in like school mein no delay like be on time so till now i am like that habit of mujhe time se karna hai like time become an essential factor in my life because of him only he used to make wo har parents karte hain nowadays also so he used to make ghadi mein wo 10 minutes forward karke and then yeah. you don't <laughs> you don't miss your school time 
We used to do that. Different, but I think those times it was like really app. Fifteen minutes before, some half hour before, one hour before, watch was put on. That was the yes. thing. Uh, you know, few of uh, them do. Yes. So, yeah, we we have Vishaka who is uh, also saying that her father didn't recognize her when she did uh, did got dressed up uh, in a annual function. So yeah. Yeah, uh, like I was uh, uh, in a getup of. Um, uh, Uh, north northeastern uh, get up like shawl uh, like wrap up in a shawl and uh, wo uh, uh, head ko thoda ponytail uh, thoda high ponytail karke and spike straws was there on my head like a proper northeast uh, uh, northeast get up so what happened like wo thoda dark tha environment and backstage sab function khatam ho gaya then uh, my uh, like father came to like pick me up so there were three four uh, girls were there teacher were there so uh, we were all standing there only and he he asked my teacher where is vipasha and i was there and my teacher was smiling she is here only sir and he couldn't recognize me how i like complete makeover so uh, he didn't recognize me at all so we were keep on laughing to aap apne bacche ko bhi aapne nahi pehchana and he was like are like such a get up how can i recognize itna like transform get up that he was not able to recognize me yeah to name two friends from your school and two friends from your college whom you are still in touch with hmm from a uh, school i am in uh, uh, touch with uh, many of them like school friends uh, i am very close to school friends so they are really really close swati uh, singh is one of my closest friend mm-hmm. uh, then megha is there uh, there is so much so minal so they are my school friends they are my batchmates classmates so okay. again one more swati so they are my like really besties so shreya 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 nayan is my like plus two bestie friend like i when i was in 11th 12th till now we are in touch so she is my dear 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 friend and from college uh yeah supriya supriya is my uh, like closest friend uh there are so many so many there are so many friends yeah guys other friends who are who names are not coming out here it's not that you know she doesn't like you she, you know, yeah please please you please know, those are the names which are coming out first yeah, so yeah, yeah i mean right now for that i i would know the attempt, don't don't remove her from the school and uh, you know college whatsapp group she is just that's the, those are the first two names which are coming out so don't take her wrong yeah thank you thank you ravi for <laughs> helping me out yeah so name are not coming up yeah suddenly like yeah live live hai na isliye okay nice what what's your favorite food and uh, you know are you good at cooking no. i'm not good at cooking what is funny thing like uh, ki abhi isme bhi ek funny hai because uh, when you get married ye question aata hai to mujhe to nahi aaya my in laws are good to understand but what happened my husband is a very good cook so uh, i learned cooking from my uh, when i got my job my mother used to write me letter dal kaise banana hai khichdi kaise banani hai she used to write step by step like itni der rakhna hai 10 minutes ke liye itna pani like she used to guide me through letters the, then uh, she don't know uh, like whatsapp she was not having that whatsapp and all she used to write me letter and i used to read that letter and cook So when I got married, uh, I'm very fortunate. My husband is a very good cook. So from first day onwards, he started going in kitchen. So I was like behind, but I learned few things, a uh, few special things I cook. But uh, normally I don't love cooking. But few special dishes I learned, uh, like few dal makhani, samosa, like special special things I learned to cook. But he is good cook. Did, at what age did you learn how to uh, ride a bicycle ah yeah um, when i was i think uh, in third class yeah in third grade yeah and no, that too bicycle bicycle tricycle nahi bicycle, tricycle, tricycle. Yeah, so yeah yeah bicycle 
Yeah, yeah, bicycle. And I learned scooter also after that. Old scooter, Bajaj. <laughs> so when I learned cycle, my like my mom told me, nee, cycle to seek nahi I like fell down from cycle so many times. Either the subjaga like either chot lagi, either chot lagi. I was like crying, mujhe nahi seekna. but my mama nahi, nahi, seekna hi hai. You have to learn. Like this is this is first step to independence when you learn bicycle, right? Like uh, this, she taught me like that. You have to learn this. Then uh, I thought, okay, I will learn scooter also. That was really difficult to learn scooter, gear and change. And it was like really heavy Bajaj scooter. Yeah. So, so scooter when it's not what do they do? What do I miss that. Scooter when it's not what it's not first kick, what do they do? I think choke and then you do that. Okay. Then you don't start again. Next, what do you do? Push it, I think. No, no. Then you have not learned scooter, how to drive a Bajaj scooter. I, I <laughs> forgot. I forgot. I take long uh, back. Please, please uh, help her out. If Bajaj scooter if it doesn't start in first kick, what do you do? Please comment here. Yeah, please comment. Know. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so that, that's all about rapid fire question. But one question I have. Uh, about you you have defined uh, yourself what is that uh, you know deep inside you uh, as a personality what what is vipasha if we have to describe in one word or one sentence yeah i uh, like i am a dreamer right i i just uh, uh, i am in my dreams i i just want to achieve uh, if you want to like describe vipasha in one word it will be like I want to achieve something in life. Uh, something. Uh, I am just trying to achieve. That will satisfy me from within. So I am in the path of that. Uh, I just want to discover myself. How much I can do. Uh, how much I can learn. How much I can uh, give back to people. Through stories only. That will be the path. But I don't know till where I will go. But that will be my path. Okay. So, director, sir, you know, last question or a question. No? I don't mind. Yeah. So, as a director, you would have, you know, gone through my profile. So, tell something about uh, my profile. Okay. Your profile. I, I put some videos and, uh, you know, some pictures. So, what is that you find uh, in things? You which are from the right. you... Apart from the interviews. Yeah, you are very creative, I must say. So you can also try to like change this line and you can come and join hands with us and we can together create something uh, unique. Because I can see like you are really, really creative in whatever things you do, the shots. I've seen your photographs and you're really, really into it. Like that is something uh, that is hidden. Like uh, when you see the photograph, something, some, some message will some some message will click in your mind like what is behind that what is the meaning of i love few of your photographs recently like some bird nest photograph i just really love that photograph i i just really really so i think we both can uh, work together in future like Thank both you. creative <laughs> yeah <laughs> so director wait, photographer so you know she's trying to convince me on that so audience don't don't you know remember this so we might be shooting one together. Yes, definitely, definitely. Okay, so any questions for the director? Uh, you know, feel free to ask. Uh, in the meanwhile, uh, the final question for you. So, Vipasha, if you become the chief minister, what are the areas you would focus on? Yeah, iska answer I will give it in a very uh, like different way. Mm -hmm. As a parent, I will tell you when a like parent become like. Mm, uh, so I, I am a mother of nine year old kid. So when I become a CM, if suppose, then I will always, my perspective will be around children only. So my first thing will be education. Yeah. Uh, so the current education system, what we are having, uh, personal, it's my personal feeling. I'm not happy about it. And uh, I want more innovative uh, in an education system, like how you can involve the interest of the kids more it is very tedious for uh, us as a parents and for teachers also to 
मेक दम लाइक अटेंशन स्पैन इतना छोटा है एंड दे आर लाइक इट्स हार्ड टू मेक दम अंडरस्टैंड फ्यू थिंग्स सो बीइंग अ सीएम आई विल डेफिनेटली वांट टू वर्क ऑन एजुकेशन सिस्टम मोर एंटरटेनिंग एंड मोर इन्वॉल्विंग वे लाइक बिकॉज स्पैन का अटेंशन स्पैन इज वेरी लेस फॉर किड्स सो डेफिनेटली वांट टू वर्क ऑन वेरी लेस गुड गुड पॉइंट विमर्श सो या गुड इंटरेक्शन Uh, so all the best in whatever you are doing any help you need from you know all the friends uh, uh, you know in the work community you know feel free to ask raise a thing announce what you are planning to do uh, we had few artists you know uh, you know stage artists there are few performers who also participated in the earlier episodes so anything you can uh, you know plan you know utilizing their talent because every person has a, a certain character in their uh, you know the way they carry themselves with their face value with the acting yeah. like like i can do a father character now you know you have so many personalities around but feel free to ask help on this one reason uh, we have this particular small community getting built up uh, you know after these episodes where we can help each other and try to uh, get things done much faster uh and everything need not be in a commercial way but you know i think we can move faster and encourage and inspire each other so all the best for this and thanks uh, ashwita for introducing uh, you know vipasha because we have lot of uh, such uh, corner stones like vipasha who might not be very uh, matlab uh, you know very grand in you know talking themselves but they need that particular push or uh, inspiration from or challenge from others that yes you have to you have to expose yourself to uh, the society uh, so but thanks for taking time out for vipasha i mean it's it's glad knowing you uh, it's glad knowing about your uh, you know childhood school days and especially about your super mom who's in all yeah. uh, and all that I mean, she she is uh, really you know uh, making the rest of our parents uh, feel jealous so good thank you thank you thank for taking time out so friends we have some more inspiring stories coming in so stay tuned keep inspiring if you are not able to watch live uh, take some time out watch out follow people uh, you know we have new friends here uh, the uh, entire agenda is so that we can follow them follow these inspiring stories and support wherever we can and you know we answer love care you know some of these uh, you know responses to whatever the, uh, they are doing uh, is really valuable so do follow them i'll share the links below and uh, appreciate their work thank you all have a great evening ahead thank you vipasha god bless and all the best with whatever you're doing be very creative thank you so much ravi and i'm i'm just uh, feeling so much grateful going back to my childhood memories it was like it was refreshing so i will i will be in this mode i today today i will be in this mode now my childhood memories <laughs> thank you so much thank you so much and thank most you so welcome. much <laughs> most welcome and i'll get ready to uh, you know be part of the the photographer for you sure 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 chalo